my loves. Right, this is a little bit later than usual because I've had a very, very bad day. But I wanted to show you um, some really quick, simple kind of Halloween nails. I'm using Lacente's Tour Ife. I'm using Black and Tinsel Mix from Smiley's Glitter Store. And these brand new decals that will be available on my website. They are hand drawn by the amazing Zara from ZGC Elite. So um, yeah, she's one of my ambassadors and she's also producing the most incredible decals. Um, and some of these designs are like hand drawn hand designed by her so they're exclusive to my website and they will be launched like incredibly soon very very soon ridiculously soon i just can't give you the exact day yet because it's a surprise but love me um so i'm gonna do two coats of this beautiful nude called tour eiffel uh it's tour eiffel but it just doesn't sound as nice when i say it like that that's from lacente you can save money with my code sarah 10 at lacente uh there you go that's the first coat in fact you could just get away with one coat look that's one coat but i did do two because well i just did i did two so and they are a 30 second cure in an led lamp there we go, just going in with the second coat there. Very, very nice. Right, the decals, there you go. This is the first one I'm gonna use. Pop it in water for 20 to 30 seconds and then pop it onto the nail. As I was grabbing it, I caught the corner with my sharp tweezers, but I just um, pushed it back into place and it went back perfectly, so there was no problem there. And you will notice the quality of these is um, incredible. So I have used a lot of different decals and some of them like they feel very thin and they crack or you can't move them they lose their color um or the the like the decal bit itself feels really really uh like i can't flimsy uh, these are really good the color is incredible in them there will be a few videos out from my ambassadors showing you just how good these are so you can kind of have a good look at how they work before you buy um and as you can see, I've put them over nude and not white uh, because you can with these, they're cool. So I'm gonna take some of this glitter from Smiley's and I'm gonna kind of glitter ombre. So from the tip, ombre and up, and it's just going into the sticky layer. And then I'll do some from the cuticle area, ombre and down. Don't worry, we will be adding bling. Of course, I mean, come on now. So tap, tap, tap it in really gently. The glitter will lay nice and flat. And then you can just pop some base coat on over the top and then top coat. This is so simple. If you can't do, I mean, I couldn't draw this particular design hand drawn. I'm terrible at moons. Um, so using something like this is just super easy, super quick and easy. There you go, look at that. So that's top coat, it is going in the lamp. Let's move on to the next one. Same thing, soak the decal, peel it off. You can see how sturdy it is actually, for the way I'm manhandling it. I'm not the most delicate, let's be honest. It's borderline aggressive the way I'm handling this. I'm like, get into place, shove it into place. And then I forgot to put the base coat down on top. So I was like, pop the glitter on, then I went, oh, bugger, base coat. So. There you go, base coat. Because you know it's all about the base, about the base. No trouble. <laughs> right, it's cured, it's sticky. So let's push some more glitter into that and then just kind of run it up the sides a little bit. Really simple. Um, I was gonna do my nails today, my other hand, because my gel is really grown out, but I didn't have time because we're decorating Oliver's bedroom. So we had to go out and get carpet and get a bed. And um, I'm not decorating because I'm, well, broken. My, my body's broken, but Mr. B's decorating. And I was packing all your orders. Um, yeah, thank you for all the support and continued just love and support and all the messages and tagging me in your designs. It makes me so happy. It really, really does. And it keeps me busy, so it keeps me out of trouble. 
So, um, yeah, that's had a base coat. Now it's going to have a top coat. Whack it on. Oh, look at it. Valparetto. Look at that. Now, don't worry if it's lumpy bumpy, um, like little bits here and there with the glitter or whatever, because we'll sort that out in a minute. On to the next nail. I'm using a lint-free wipe. I should call them supposedly lint-free wipes to push out any moisture, which I might have left because I'm not particularly good at getting the moisture bubbles out. So, and then I'm just stretching it over the sides there. Can you see? You can file that off or use acetone. Zara has created some really, really comprehensive instructions. So please do not fear. She's got your back. There we go. Pop that in. Yes, I've contaminated my base coat. Aren't I a clever girl? Um, good job I've got about a gazillion. So I'm going to press that into the tacky layer of the base coat. Push, push, push. Nice and easy. Those little tinsel bits, um, although they're multicoloured, there's a reason I chose them, because they're going to match the bling that we're going to use in a bit. So, yeah. I really, really, really like it. Really, really, really like it. So we just push it in. Tap, 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 tap. Nice and simple. I just wanted to kind of uh, have another dimension to this nail. And I realised that I have so much glitter and I don't use it enough. So I really wanted to just do some more and kind of frame the decals. So I'm going to apply base coat and then we'll go in with the top coat. Same as before. Pop it in the lamp. Quick cure. Back in with the top coat. Ooh, look at it, it's all shiny and smooth. Mm, I like, I love top coat. I just love watching it go on. It's like, ah. Okie dokie. Time to do the last one. Look at this. See, they're so intricate. She's very clever. And we're gonna pop them on, squeeze it out, move it around. It doesn't break. As you can see, I am rather aggressive. Probably a bit too. I've probably been very lucky that I didn't break it. And then I'm going to tap that in. I don't need a base coat yet because I'm tapping it into the bottom. Uh, if I'm tapping it over the edges of the decal, then obviously I need to put a base coat in first. But for this bit, I didn't. There we are, just on brain that glitter up. Really simple. Tap it in around the cuticle area. Same as before. Very nice. In with base coat. You're getting bored of this now, aren't you? Don't worry, the bling's coming. Don't worry. I got you. Cure it. In with top coat. Nice and simple. In the lamp. And then we're going to get down to business. Or blingness. <laughs> I'm so funny. I'm really not. Right, get a buff. Buff, buff, buff. Buff it. Buff off that shine. You can't apply crystals to shiny nails. It just... It just, it'll take ages for the adhesive to set if you're using like a, a normal adhesive. So just buff it or use a matte top coat first, but I decided to use a gloss and then buff it. So I'm using Raven. These are available on my website and Midnight Sparkle for this design. All available on the website. I'll link it in the description box below. And Bling Bond adhesive, which is available in the UK only, not overseas because it can't be shipped so sorry not not my fault um and we're going to just i just do you know what i didn't plan this this is i always say this don't i i did not plan this design i literally just had an idea and went with it so i'm mixing the different crystals so i've put one of the raven which is just like a really jet black sparkly crystal and then the midnight sparkle which are like a deep blue deep purple and they shimmer with gold and a bit of green and then some more of the raven and the two bounce off each other like beautifully so that's that one done beautiful and on the next one i'm going to do a cuff design so in with one of the midnight sparkles then raven either side and then raven around the front so i'm kind of encasing one of the midnight sparkles a slightly larger one I think that's an SS12, the big one in the middle. Oh, someone's gone past on an annoying motorbike that sounds like a broken hairdryer. How nice. There we are. And I did the same on the other two as well. So that's what we've got now. Look at it. 
It was so pretty. And we're going to top coat now. It's time to shine. So I'm going in with the gloss top coat. And, and then I'm going to use my detailer brush to tuck it in all around the crystals. Don't go over them. It is a crime and I will come and arrest you. So don't do that. It's very naughty. The bling police will be on your case. There we are. All around the other side as well. And you can tuck it in. See, tuck it around the edges. It will stop them pinging off. There we are. Tuck it in, tuck it in. Down the edges, tuck it all in. It'll be fine. There we are. And tuck a bit in the middle there. Woohoo! And then we need to give it a thorough cure. And I'm going to top coat the others as well. My dog's having a dream, so can you hear him? <laughs> He's having a little dream. <laughs> oh, so cute. He's really poorly at the moment. There we go. Tuck it in all around the crystals. Oh, and Jordan's playing his guitar. So if you can hear a lovely guitar, it is Jordan playing. Or oh, unless I've got some music in the background and it might be that. <laughs> Couldn't tell you right now because I haven't edited it yet. So I don't know what I'm what I'm doing, to be fair. Right, top coat the other ones. You, you know what this involves. I'm just going to speed it up a bit because it's uh, boring otherwise. And then once they're top coated, obviously they're going to be cured and I am going to do a little reveal video. And I did too because I, I get frustrated sometimes when there's lines from the light because I want you to see the design. So I did two different videos at the end so you could actually see the design in its entirety. Please um, add yourself to my mailing list on the website. I will not spam you with useless crap or try and get you to buy everything every five minutes. It's only there for letting you know if I have a new launch or if something is restocked, okay? Um, or like if there's a competition, but that's, that's not, I normally do that on social media. So I would advise that you get on the mailing list. I will not spam you. It will be like just to let you know when these decals go live. Here we go, there's the finished nails. Aren't they gorgeous? Oh my goodness. Also, if you like Halloween gonks, then I'm gonna link a video for you because they're going on the website too soon. <gasps> yes, they gonks. are. Halloween. Ah! Look, there's another view of them. I really hope you've enjoyed this video. I will see you in the next one. Tally bye. <laughs>